Us on the phone right now is the Jayhawks head coach. This is Roy Hall. Coach Hall, thank you for joining us. You're welcome. H how did you know that something was wrong? How were you alerted that there was a situation? Well, there was approximately two minutes left in the game, and my daughter was on the sideline. She said, Dad, there was a shooting in front of the gate. I said, what? And once he said that, the public address system got on and was calling for the referee and a call a referee. And then when I said that and I heard that, I instructed our whole team to go to the locker room, and then they had Amani go to their locker room. But I want to make it perfectly clear, it had nothing to do with the game inside, nothing at all. And it's a bad thing that happened. It's another black eye towards Jeanette. But it had nothing to do with the game. It happened outside the fence and the gate. So as the head coach, what did you say to your players once you got into the locker room? Well, the first thing I did, because our players, you know, their families are in the stands, and I got a call from our superintendent, and he assured me and told me that the perpetrator was in custody. He was in the police car. So I assured him their families were safe and everything, and they tended to calm down. And with that, they, they calmed down because they wanted to go see their family because with everything going on in the world, didn't know if it was an active shooter, somebody just shooting randomly. But it ended up, it was two individuals that had something against each other and it happened outside the gate. which It just destroyed the whole night and I'm not sure what happened at the end. All right, Coach Hall, thanks so much for that update and we're glad that uh, all of you and the players and the folks in the stands were okay tonight. Yes, thank you.